Hello guys, welcome back to another video of Daily SpaceX Updates. In this video, we will look at the latest updates of Starship testing, SpaceX's Falcon Heavy mission, and Polaris Dawn updates. It's Monday, a new day, a fresh start to an important week for SpaceX. SpaceX has resumed testing on the Starship Booster 7 and Ship 24. What we are expecting in this round of testing is a full-stack wet dress rehearsal. Possible road closure schedules are posted on the Cameron County website throughout the week from 8 a.m. to 8 p.m. Marine Safety Information Bulletin MSIB notice was issued to Mariners for possible Starship testing from 21 to the 28th of October 2022. Don't forget to subscribe to not miss out on any updates on the testing of Starship today or in the coming days. After almost three and a half years, SpaceX's most powerful rocket in operation, Falcon Heavy arrives at SpaceX's Hangar X at Launch Complex 39A at Kennedy Space Center. United States Space Force's USS F-44 mission will carry two classified payloads directly to geostationary orbit. This will be the fourth overall Falcon Heavy launch for SpaceX and will be quite a show to watch the nicely synced strap-on boosters landing. Unfortunately, the main center core booster will be expended this time. It is an unusual thing for SpaceX to lose a booster, but this one will make it to the list of boosters that provided great service to mankind and didn't make it to the land again. Polaris Program announced today a list of 38 scientific projects from 23 partner institutions that the Polaris Dawn mission will conduct during their five-day mission to space. These scientific experiments or projects are designed to advance both human health on Earth and on future long-duration spaceflights. The partners include NASA, SpaceX, the United States Air Force Academy, and 25 others. Polaris Dawn mission is currently scheduled for launch in March next year in 2023. On Saturday, the Indian Space Research Organization launched its first commercial mission with its medium lift launch vehicle, LVM-3 or Launch Vehicle Mark III One, rocket. Zero. The heaviest rocket ever made by India launched 36 OneWeb satellites into low Earth orbit from Satish Dhawan Space Center in Andhra Pradesh. It was a historic mission for India for this newest family of rockets. Even though ISRO is not as big as NASA or SpaceX, the premier Indian space agency has a reputation for accomplishing space missions with low budgets and providing cheaper launch costs compared to other companies. Despite being a slow runner in the space race, the future is bright for the Indian space program. Well, that is it for this video. Hope you enjoyed the short update. If you did, please like the video. Goodbye, see you in the next video.